to Liquid Volume and Math. Hope you enjoy the show. Mass is a measurement of how much matter is in an object. We can measure mass using units like grams or kilograms. Volume is the amount of three-dimensional space something takes up. It can also be called capacity. We measure volume using units like liters. Davis poured about two liters of milk into a jug. Which arrow shows about how much milk Davis poured into the jug? In this problem, we're trying to find the arrow that is closest to two liters. So here's two liters. The arrow closest to it would be this one, arrow two. Here's another. The picture below shows that one box is heavier than six identical cans. The box has a mass of 54 kilograms. What could be the mass in kilograms of one can? Well, if they were balanced and they had the same mass, we would calculate 54 divided by 6, which is 9. So 6 cans that were 9 kilograms each would equal 54 kilogram box. But since we know that the 54 kilogram box has a greater mass, the cans must have a mass less than 9 kilograms each. If we look at the answer choices, the only mass less than 9 is six. So that must be our answer, six. This one says, Carmen filled up his bathtub with 105 liters of hot water and 26 liters of cold water. What is the total volume in liters of the water in the bathtub? For this, we would need to add 105 liters plus 26 liters which equals 131 liters. So 131 liters would be our answer. Let's try one last one. When Franklin and Judah stood on the scale together, the scale read 44 kilograms. When Judah stood on the scale by himself, the scale read 19 kilograms. What would be the reading on the scale if Franklin stood on it by himself? Well, if they're 44 kilograms together, that's their total. That means 44 kilograms equals Franklin's mass plus Judah's mass. And if Judah's mass is 19 kilograms, we're looking for 19 plus what is 44? To solve, we can use a related math fact, 44 minus 19. That gives us an answer of 25 kilograms. You're, You're now, now ready, ready to take, take on, on the problems. problems. Good luck. Good luck.